Hey everybody, how's it going? We're Pops with Purpose. I'm Michael. And Faith. And we're here today to do some more mystery box unboxing. So we have, we actually have three boxes today. One is from Fugitive, uh, from the Friday, just grill, possible grill mystery boxes they've been doing. They're 10 bucks, uh, not a whole lot of uh, what could be in there. Most likely we're going to get a common, um, but there's chances for some pretty, pretty good grills. And then on top of that, we have two boxes from Stop, Pop, and Roll, and this was a search for trunks. Um, I believe these boxes were 25. Um, and then Mr. Mark over there at Stop, Pop, and Roll, he did a sale over uh, Labor Day weekend, and I believe it was 20. Um, they may have been cheaper. I don't honestly even remember what they were. So, uh, but they were a good deal. That's why I ended up just grabbing another one. So there was some, can you pull that up? There was some awesome stuff in that one. Um, and it, you know what? We'll be right back right after this. Okay, guys, we're back. Sorry about that. Um, let me just explain to you real quick what was in the, um, what was possible in the stop, pop, and roll boxes. There were couple of the trunks chases which is why he called it hunt hunt for the trunks um, the one i'm actually really hoping to get is the razor ramon chase which is autographed um what else there's a lot of different chases um there's a madame leota in there from haunted mansion um there is the dapper dance that one would be awesome to get but these boxes are too small for that so i know that's not in there um there was a few different two packs you could get. Um, there's some Jordans. There's the dead or um, the Ghost Rider, Venomized Ghost Rider. There's Popeye. There's the Alex Trebek chase, which I wouldn't mind getting. Some Michael Jordans. Um, there's a there's a glow in the dark Jolly Bee and Barong. Um, some of the SDCC pops. So there was definitely some cool stuff. You, I mean, realistically, you couldn't go wrong with these boxes for the price. So. We grabbed a couple of them and as you guys may remember we've done a video unboxing some of his stuff in the past uh super super good customer service um i couldn't recommend him enough um awesome shipping you know the boxes were great so go and check them out at stoppopandroll.com um, he's been having a lot of different mystery boxes up for sale he had some this past week that were eight bucks um, and you can get a couple of awesome pops so I mean, for eight bucks, you can't go wrong, you know. So we're going to get into it. Uh, we'll start with the fugitive box, and then we'll do the two stop, pop, and roll boxes that we got. Where is my knife at? There it is. Knife. Knife. Careful. I'm slice the pop. Fugitive pops are coming with the brown paper on them, sort of like Poptopia. I think last week we got Pam Beasley. I don't know. I've never seen that. So this is Gargoyles from Disney. This is Broadway. Um, I, I never did really watch this when I was a kid. It's actually a really cool pop. He has like a turkey leg in his, um, in his hand. It's actually really detailed. I, I like this pop. Um, like I said, I, we, we don't really collect these. I didn't really watch this show growing up, but, um, this really is a cool pop. Yeah. I, um, I like this one. So, this. so there's that. So that was sort of, I think the thing that Fugitive is doing is kind of releasing some pops every week for 10 bucks, sort of a grail or fail thing. They, they put a few, uh, really high end grails in there and then a lot of commons. So, so, you know, for 10 bucks, you got a shot at something really good. So. Here we go. These are the two. There's no number on this one. Um, 17. That one doesn't have a number. I don't remember if I chose numbers on these. But. Huh. Alright. So. Mm -hmm. We'll see. I think there was numbers to choose. But honestly I don't remember what I chose. I typically try to stay with the same numbers. Which is like 12. Which is my wife's favorite number. Or 24. Which is mine. 10. Which is Faith's. Or if that, those don't work 13. out, then I'll try to go with like birthdays oh, yeah. or something like that, you know, so. 
All right, guys, let's see. I like that, these ships and sorters. You got a new business card here, stop, pop, and roll. Is it like the scratchy kind? No. No, it's actually very cool. It's got some like uh, holographic type paint on it. That's cool. Uh, with his name and the website's name. Those are very cool. We'll add that to our collection. I like that he ships and sorters. There it is, number 12. Oh, cool. See? And then he puts his little sticker on it to keep it shut. So he awesome. Puts it on here too. Awesome job doing that. It's a nice touch. We won't forget who he is. Oh, sweet. We actually have this pop already, but super cool pop to pull. Especially for 20 or 25 bucks. It's the glow in the dark. Moaning Myrtle from 2018 Summer Convention. Ooh. Really cool pop. And the glow on this thing is amazing. Really we've, good. We've lit her up with our other one. She's up top over here out of out of screen with um, with Luna, Luna Lovegood, Lovegood with, with the sunglasses. Glasses. So awesome. All right. If we're going to get a duplicate, I don't mind getting that one. I'm going to do that top. Thing. All right. So let's see what, what does that... Uh, mean for us in this box. Can you show them your shirt? Oh yeah, my new shirt. Says the periodic table for the element iron. And then man, you guys know I love my shirts. Cool little different take on it, Iron Man. And this one is number 10, so it's fitting that Faith ended up with that. It is. That's Faith's favorite number. That's the, that's the soccer number that she usually likes to wear. Or 13. Did it not go all the way through? No, it did. All right, what did we get? Yes, I wanted this one. Yes, yes. Yes. Oh, this is sweet. So the Disney Parks exclusive. It's the basketball Mickey. You know where he's like half. He's in like midair and he's gonna dunk the ball. I wanted this one. I thought it was cute. So yes, got Mickey. Mouse. Very cool. Leave us some comments, guys, if you know exactly what this is all about. Because it says NBA Experience. It's a Disney Parks exclusive. Um. So, you know, I'm not even sure like what the deal was with this um i've seen it many times but um i'm just not sure what that deal is with disney and the nba experience so if any of you guys know what that is then leave us a comment and let us know um you know can't say enough good things about mr mark bowen over at stop pop and roll so so moaning myrtle is $34. Okay, so Morning Myrtle at 34. And then um, and this one Mickey. This one this one if we bought it at the park 24.99. It's $43. Wow. So 43 bucks for Mr. Mickey Mouse. So we came out ahead. We're we're about um you know, I got one for 25 and one for 20 when that sale was going on. So 45 bucks. I mean Basketball Mickey pays for both of them, and you know the thirty-four for Moaning Myrtle is icing on the cake. So we're at seventy-seven dollars total um, value. And how about Mr. Broadway over there? We didn't check him. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Just out of curiosity. So definite win on the stop, pop, and roll boxes, guys. And just so, just to you know, I when I buy mystery boxes, I try and look at everything that's in it if I can. I I enjoy that. Uh, stop pop and roll gives you a picture of everything that'll be in there um that sort of helps me figure out whether i even want to bother because you know when we first started doing mystery boxes especially with like poptopia and stuff like that like you had to get on it right now and buy the box but i always wasn't always really interested even in the grill so um you know i try to pay attention to that and make sure that there is actually things in there that i want to try and get before i buy them so eight dollars okay so broadway's just a common we paid 10 he's worth eight so that's a you know we figured that so guys go and check out stop pop and roll check out fugitive they've been doing uh their weekly mystery boxes for 10 bucks um and then check out stop pop and roll he's got a few different things going on he also had eight dollar mystery boxes with a chance at some awesome girls one of them being booberry so stay tuned for that because i bought two of those and those should be coming up pretty soon guys so 
Thank you, as always, for watching. What's the question? Mm, I don't know. Mm. You don't know. What's your favorite store to shop at? For pops or just shopping? No, just like shopping. Like for clothes, shopping for clothes. I, I imagine girls. Well, I don't know. I'm. I like clothes. I like t-shirts. Yeah. So. What's your favorite store? For. Ugh. Honestly, probably Walmart. You guys are probably thinking, what a wacko, but this shirt came from Walmart. Mine is H&M. H&M. So let us know, guys. Um, we, we love it when you guys leave us comments. We love interacting with you. We love learning more about uh, you guys that faithfully watch our videos, and we, we appreciate that so much. You know, we, we're moving along. We're close to... 300 I can't believe it we're at like 274 I think as we're recording this so that's insane to me so that's all because of you guys and we really appreciate it um, most likely as we we are recording this it's Thursday I'm not sure when this will come out I need to do a better job of figuring out what days they're gonna get uploaded so I can address that you know and say hey it's Friday or whatever um, maybe that doesn't matter to some of you but um, and I totally forgot what I was going to say. Everyone has a purpose. What's yours? No, it wasn't that yet. I did have something to say, but if I remember, I'll put it in the description. So thanks, guys, again for watching. We appreciate it. Um, thank you guys for supporting us. Oh, that's what it was. We're probably not going to make it to our bonus for the 300 subscribers, but as soon as we get there, the full Cal Deku will be given away um, on that video that we put out a couple days ago. So... Guys, thanks again. We appreciate it. Everyone has a purpose. What's yours? Bye.